very nice like you are in a movie eh. Can you see how clear the sky is? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> don't let your gut down. I think the cooker don't like me. The situation is we can't find the ferry ticket, which means that we can't go back. So we start. We are back in Australia. The last time I was in Perth right, was nine years ago when your boss Brian was still my intern. Whoa. Now we are back here at his head of production. Whoa. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, this is uh Jody. Jody is coming along to this trip with us because we have no pretty faces. Jody will be uh in charge of uh looking pretty in all our shots. Okay. We arrived yesterday close to midnight and we booked our hotel to Club. The hotel is called Ingot Hotel. The good thing about this year is because we reached very late. Yeah. And then we need to find a hotel that's nearby, ma. Right. So it's just like a five to ten minutes drive yeah. away from the airport. We just arrived to sleep here mm. and then today, right, we're just going to have lunch and then drive another six hours to our next hotel. Then only tomorrow, we'll start our activity. The last time I came to Perth, right, nine years ago, right, it was rather boring. <laughs> ah, I don't know this change or not. You know what? Yeah, la, go ah, 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 You ah, scared ah, what? I make sure this is the most exciting trip. <laughs> 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 Okay, so uh, then we will be heading to our lunch first. Okay, we are at Egg Yolk. What I'm having is the signature French fried chicken. I'm having the salmon croquet with smoked salmon. First meal of Puff. I'm going to give you a try. So it's like blended chicken, but the crust outside right is encrusted with herbs. The chicken still retains a lot of moisture and it's very tender. I like it and the portion is very good. It's very nice right, the cooking. It has yeah. those bits of vegetables that give it a bit of crust. And then outside is very crispy, inside is very fluffy. I'm having the eggs benedict. Actually, I don't really eat eggs benedict one lah. Then what about your order? Yeah. I just like the egg lah, but it's very creamy though. If you uh, like eggs, yeah. I think you should come here, it's really good. Yeah, eggs is really on another level. That's why they call themselves eggs. Hello, this is our captain speaking. Uh, we are currently embarking to our next location. My co pilot would like to share some of to The time now is 7.15 and the weather is 15 degrees, so I hope thank you for taking my nice weather. <laughs> <laughs> no, they cannot hear. Okay, okay now it's Jody's debut music. Like Singapore. Tell me why ain't nothing but a heartache. Tell me why ain't nothing but a mistake. Tell me why. My fire. <laughs> After breakfast, we are heading up to Calvary. So I've been driving for one hour, one more hour to my end of my shift, the Titus Hotel. But look at the view. We park the car by the side of the road. We're gonna take a short break. My back literally breaking. Just now I sleep off this uh, rocky road and uh, I spent my way. The first reaction for all my crew and uh, everyone here is just to laugh. Nobody help me. Now it's 6.45am and we are leaving Kalbari Ish Resort. The staff were very uh, competitive even though we check in very late. The rooms are also very spacious. There are some rooms that I saw like a balcony and all. There's also a lot of wildlife here as evident. Uh, you will see kangaroos uh, around there. Yeah, rather interesting and quiet place. So there. Of course not. No. Someone said fashion more than comfort. <laughs> who? I wonder who. I don't, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Is it not cold? This one is to protect me from the flies. Oh, from not the, the flies. Not the cold. So we are at our first activity of our trip, the Kabari Skywalk. We are currently right here. We're gonna walk here. Yeah. Oh, okay. Look at your face, I can tell you're scared of heights. Yeah. <laughs> you're scared of heights, so. Are you? Yes, I am. Uh, <laughs> 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 
Watch your thoughts. Very nice ride. Right? You are in a movie. Eh? Can you see how clear the sky is? The view. So nice. The place here overall very beautiful, very breathtaking. The view is excellent. There's also a uh, nature's window down there. You have to uh, go through a hike. That's a little bit pain. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not abusing. Just a lot of flies on us. We don't want to bring it into the car. Hey, yo, still have more. You got a lot of flies. We are currently at Gilgai Tavern. Fun fact, this place only accepts reservation. What we are having is their signature calamari, seafood marinara, steak and chicken snitch. So, since I'm paying for this meal, I should be quite honest. It's meh. One word is, it's edible. It's not as bad as they say it is. To me, it's near the sea. So they are produced, no, right? Produce is better. It's a lot better. Just for sure. So we are currently at Pink Lake and we booked this tour. It's the Pink Lake Buggy Tour and it's very cool because it's actually not accessible via like your own transport. You have to take the special buggy to come here and the ride was also very fun. A bit like Jurassic Park. Like you know like you're in those like car thing. Yeah, yeah, like, yeah. Fun. Then you can see the very pink lake over here. So it's currently dry season now. It's not raining much lately. So the lake is actually more orangey than pink but from a higher height right you can tell that it's actually really pink but i think it's still very pretty because i haven't seen a lake that's this color before For dinner, we are at the Sandpiper Durian Bay. We are having curry chicken, pork belly rice, laksa, beef chick, and max pizza, which is all the ingredients. I have to say, the food here surprisingly good. Everything is good so far. Very good. I like this. It's day three, and before we head out, uh, I'm just going to show you the place. This is Durian Bay Tourist Park. So this is our accommodation. This is our living room. This is the kitchen area and dining area, which we haven't used. There's two rooms here. And then uh, this is the shower room, and this is the toilet. Pretty nice place. I like this place. We are having breakfast at Meraki, and I'm having this dish called the Lot, which is, I believe, their big breakfast. Jody is having marinated mushrooms. It looks very veganish. I have to say, the food is also very good. Still very good. Uh, I don't know what's this Jurel Bay all about, but all their food has been very good so far. It's just everything done right. Like, look at their poached egg. I've never seen such a beautiful poached egg. It's so perfect looking. The toast is very good. It's like, you can hear the sound. It's like crispy on the outside. And it's also very nicely like coated with, I think, butter or something. Very nice. What are you trying to do? We're going to do Easter 360 Titan Run. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, right now we have a situation here. So this guy's not looking too good and uh the seems like the goddess of Olympus is like not on our side. What do you think? What? I can't even understand what you just said. <laughs> last time I've been to Perth, I never get to see Pinnacles. Today's the day you achieve your dream. This is the day that I can fulfill my bucket list. We're waiting for the rest of the crew to come out and then we are sandboard now. But we don't have a sandboard. We're gonna borrow from our friend there. Say hi! Hi! You're from Singapore! Very interesting many people from Singapore. Yeah, because uh, also we, from Singapore. We actually did booking uh, for their parents' store. That's serious? Yeah. And then what your D3 style? No, it was not a very good <laughs> Oh! 
Oh, it's got your foundation come already. <laughs> is that flower? No, it's makeup. Oh, Easy! Let's go! Yeah. Yeah. He has to. Camera pressure, it's cool. Alright, man! Get to it, man! <laughs> oh, whoa, whoa, whoa! <laughs> <laughs> I think the thing about your car, send you not is they also give you free makeup lesson. They teach me how to put foundation. Anyone saw Ben or not? I only saw the memoirs of a geisha. <laughs> Toshio. We are currently at Pinnacles and it's raining rather heavily. And they say uh, for the last six months, right, this is the third time it rained. So in the last six months, right, only rained two times and this is the third time. So even though it's raining, right, our tour guides, right, they, they're very we don't they're so. determined because they're gonna cook for <laughs> dinner. Cooking in the rain, yeah. Aussie style. Put another sausage on the barbie, mate. <laughs> Hopefully the, it won't be soggy sausages. So we are given some food. This is I think our dinner. It's still drizzling a bit but this is basically sausage and like some bread. There's salad there also but I don't eat vegetables. <laughs> okay, let me take the first bite. Mm. Nice. The sausage is that nice. Oh really? Because they grew on the spot. Right. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, so it's like... It's really good at the sausage. Got standard one. Yo standard. Uh. Yo standard. The, the, the. Look over there. Two wild kangaroos. These two kangaroos look pretty dangerous. One kick and I'm dead. I'm gonna touch it. Do I look different today? Today, this guy helped me draw eyebrow because there's this shot in Japan uh, where we went to eat the roll. Then the light shine on my face, right? My eyebrow gone there. Eh. I'm very self conscious now, so I asked this guy helped me draw. Give me your fiercest look with the eyebrow. Go <laughs> 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 look you, you look like your half face paralyzed. <laughs> Right, this place called Cicerello. Nine years ago when I came to Perth, right, it's the only place I remember the food was very good. It's a very beautiful environment here. There's a lot of things to see and walk around. And as you can tell, it's very noisy from the birds that are surrounding us. You look, look, we are literally surrounded by the birds. <laughs> One piece of fish dropped down. Don't let your gut down. So we are having traditional fish and chips, grilled fish and chips, chili mussels, and seafood platter. Yeah, fish and chips standard still remain one of the best. The platter is like very even across the food. I think what they say is uh, it's slightly better. <laughs> it's not like uneven with a lot of crumbs. Uh, oh, I think what they meant is. <laughs> <laughs> say, what, 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 hey. the better couldn't be any better. Oh! <laughs> The lobster has a very good bite. It's very juicy all the way through. Each bite release the whole seafood flavor. The, the whole best. ocean? Uh. Yeah, the whole ocean. Yeah. The produce here is really good. It's about 5 p.m. now and we are back at the lobby. The room is very spacious. Uh, it comes with a little balcony that looks like Aries. And thankfully, the TV isn't very janky. I could easily connect my Netflix to watch. And the bathroom also comes with a bathtub. So I'm going to soak tonight. Okay, we are at Opta Stadium and we are going to do... Vertical. Oh, hey, look. It's basically a high element course whereby we'll be going quite high up and we'll be walking side by side. And if you are daring enough, you can face your fear and like look down, which I'll make Ben do it. So we're gonna go in and check it out. I can do it! Hey, 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 you see us! Uh? You see us! Uh? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? Are you okay? <laughs> ben, whose hand you're grabbing? Let's go. Whoa! Whoa. Whoa. 
what are you guys think of the activity? It's a very interesting experience. In my head, it was just it trust the harness, trust the harness. Then I just do whatever stunts they ask me to do. Okay, For me, my uh, panties are a bit wet. A bit. <laughs> but I say the coaches there all very friendly and like they lighten the mood a lot. I think I had too much confidence in myself at the start. As in, it's very fun la, overall. I think the trick for me, right, is just not to look down. She keeps saying I, she not scared, not scared. I'm not scared. I, I tried. I, I tried. I want to try, ma. So I tried law and I think I did well. La, huh? Huh? Uh, I did yeah, well. Yeah, 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 yeah. So this is a once in a lifetime experience that you guys must try. If you want to book this activity, you can book via Klook. And now let's go for dinner. We are at William Street. Uh, I think it's like they are Asian town or something. There's a lot of Asian food here and 24 hour grocery stores. Uh, we are going to have Lucky Chance noodle bar. I'll show you the very interesting thing about Lucky Chance bar. What's this? Laundry machine. What? <laughs> Oh, that's <laughs> <laughs> okay, it will appear that they don't have space, so we're gonna go eat hot pot. My saliva come out. Because I always want to eat hot pot in a cold country. <laughs> Why run when you can scoot? <laughs> so, the hot pot closes in 15 minutes, so we are going to eat Korean barbecue. I always want to eat Korean barbecue in a cold way. So we are at this quaint little Korean shop called Marubang, and we are having spicy tofu soup, fish cake soup, and also spicy pork. It's very good, nothing too extraordinary, but for this cold weather, when you drink hot soup, it's damn sure one. Bunch of Asians, Chan Gong Cha, Chen Bo Ren, Jinglai. Why are you not here? Why are you not here? I'm here to make content. Then go. Don't go, it's easy. Where are you? We're in Blue Boat House. Fun back time. It was built around 1930s and it actually has a very long history because it was once faced with demolition because last time the planks here right is like broken one so it's actually very dangerous like you cannot really walk on it. And now also cannot walk. I think you cannot walk. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, they actually redesigned and like upgraded it la. And then now it's actually a very uh, popular spot for Instagram photos You know what colour is the house? Blue la. You know why is it blue? Okay, I don't know. The owners right, they wanted a bold colour I think they like blue, that's why they picked blue That's all Hey, this is It's day 5 and we are heading to Rodner's Island to take a look at Kokas. I don't know much about them but what I know is you can actually book this activity through Klook. All the activities you see so far can be booked through Klook. Okay, we have just arrived at Rodner's. We are just going to walk around and then catch a bus later. <gasps> What's the situation? The situation is we can't find the ferry ticket which means that we can't go back. So we start. Worst case scenario is we need to stay in Rodness Island with all the cook cars. Uh. No choice, uh. it's our thing. Oh, you found it! You found it! Give Titus a kiss. Give Titus a kiss. I'll give you a kiss. <laughs> so we are currently at Salmon Bay at Rodness Island. Okay, Jody, you should have been Thankfully, we got talent to do risky things like that. Wow. I don't need to do it. We are currently at Oliver Hill, which is one of the highest points at Rodness Island. You can see all the beautiful bays from here. The weather is great today. We are very, very lucky because it's clear skies and then it's not too cold, not too hot. Perfect. Casualty! Oh, no, you share. You share. You are the person. No, you still make fun of me. No, I never. You see, see, okay, see. Show, show how you make fun. Ah. 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 So we finished the entire tour and we have one hour before our ferry depart. <laughs> I think the cooker don't like me. Hi cutie. Oh, you want me? So cute. He's my baby. We met some quokkas and they were really very cute, very gentle, they are very slow. Uh, surprisingly, they can jump. They were just pretty much just like wake up to eat only. Now we are leaving Rodner's Island and heading to dinner. 
Okay, we are at the lobby and tonight's dinner. What are we eating? Hungry Jacks. Ah, Hungry Jacks because we are hungry. hungry. Perfect. If you don't know, Hungry Jacks is actually Australia's Burger King because they cannot get a copyright. Apparently, uh, that's uh, Brian said one. Uh, if anything, what we ask? Titus here. Discuss here. Ask. Ben say one. I never see. <laughs> I ordered the grilled Angus cowboy burger. Inside is like onion ring. This is the first time I see a burger patty bigger than the bun. Eh. Brian is not a fast food on the phone. I love Lodger Silver, okay? Lodger Silver. You just proven in. my point. Lodger <laughs> Silver, I know there's a secret society that is keeping you alive in Singapore. I'm part of the secret society. I order Lodger Silver almost every week. So if you want to work with me, please contact me at my IG here. I will help you promote. I genuinely like Lodger Silver. We are at Penguin Island Visitor Centre. We're going to take a cruise. We are going to see little animals like little penguin, dolphins. After that, we are heading back to Pinnacles. Do you know that penguins poop every 20 minutes? I wanted to say that. Oh, sorry. Then you know more. Next. Do your... you know that penguins have no teeth? Do you know that penguins are monogamous? They mate for life. Do you know that penguins fly? Underwater. Which is called swimming. <laughs> <laughs> Did you know that dolphins have the highest EQ IQ among all animals? Do you know that dolphins have two stomach like 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 what? I got three. So one is for digestion, another one is for food storage. Do you know Jody just found this out three seconds ago <laughs> on her phone? Okay, we just arrived at Penguin Island. I thought it was an island of penguin, but apparently it's just this three little penguins. There's one uh, quite a showman of a penguin there. He's been standing there since the start. Thank you. Thank you. In our seven days in Perth, right, we bump into this group of Singaporeans for three times already. I start to suspect they are stalking us already. Oh um, no. It's a bit, it's a bit scary. Already. I'm a bit scared now. Okay. <laughs> you want to take the next boat? Uh, yeah, let's go. <laughs> so right now we are at the dolphin. We are looking at the dolphin, but I haven't seen any. Oh, I think. Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no. Dolphins. I think now it's breeding season, so you can actually see the mom dolphin and the baby dolphin swimming together, and it's really cute when they come up close to us. We have just arrived at our last hotel. It's called Tribe at Perth. As you can see, the lobby is very beautiful. The room design is very trendy. The toilet is also really well equipped, I would say. I highly recommend this. Just by the lobby alone, right, you know that you are in the right place. On to the next location. We're going back to the Pinnacles because it rained the entire day, so we didn't have much footage, so we have to move away. We hope to capture as much as we can. Don't know what we can capture at night, but see how it goes on. Okay, so now we are yeah, yeah, attempting yeah, to shoot yeah, the time lapse of the Milky Way. We're gonna spend like one to two hours here after taking three hours drive here and then taking three hours drive back all this for probably two seconds of the video. So we hope that you appreciate it. Thank you. We hope you enjoy our travel log. Uh, so I want to ask you all, what is your favorite activity? Jody, Jody, go first. Mine will be the Rodness Island tour because not only we get to look at the very cute kokas there, we also get to enjoy the sceneries and the different amazing bays that they have to offer. Overall, the tour is actually very well organized because we also get to like learn about the history of the place. Ben, what's your favorite? <laughs> Big hole. <laughs> My favorite is confirmed the vertigo lah. To me, it's a very once in lifetime experience. I'm someone that's very scared of heights. But the instructors were very, very entertaining. They made me feel very safe up there. For my favorite activity, it will be the sandboarding. I think it's the only activity that I've done. Right? <laughs> <laughs> 
I think that was something quite interesting because last time when I young, I got skateboard, I got snowboard before. So that was a new boarding experience that I haven't tried before. The whole tour, it is not just sandboarding, right? right, 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 right. It also brings you to the pinnacle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Once again, thank you, Klook, for sending us here. Thank you, TWA, for sending us here. Uh, it has been an experience. It's my second time in Perth and I enjoy it a lot. I hope to come back again in the future because uh, from nine years ago, it changed a lot. Uh, a lot of things is better now. It's a lot more activity and more life. And as always, follow all our socials and remember to <laughs> click up over and click up to what? You piece of <laughs> Okay, leave him here. Ah, uh, leave him here. Yeah, so you can walk away. Bye. <laughs> 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 <laughs>